Tonight and only on CBS 13, attempted murder at a state prison facility outside of Stockton. Felony convictions are possible and a sense of safety and security has been shattered. CBS 13's Madison Keevy is live in Stockton with details first reported on primetime Sacramento. Madison. The California health care facility is just on the outskirts here of Stockton. We're surrounded by farmland, warehouses, and this sprawling campus that's run by the California Department of Corrections and Rehabilitation. Let's show you some of that. We got out here tonight after we learned that an inmate attacked an employee who worked here as a custodian on Sunday morning. How it all went down is that a staff saw the prisoner choking a other employee and they used a chemical agent to subdue the attacker. Now that inmate is potentially facing attempted murder charges as well as other felony charges. The employee that was attacked, we're told, is okay but was transported just in case. Of course, this has caused some concerns from throughout employees that work here. Uh, one told us specifically anonymously uh, a quote about their own experience, and I'm going to read that to you. They told me a uh, quote that um, they, uh, I'm kind of looking here as I find what they said. Basically, they told us that they are understaffed, work a ridiculous amount of mandatory overtime and are often left working without a partner, which results in conducting custody operations outside of policy, resulting in attacks on staff. Now, of course, we reached back out to CDCR with that exact quote to see what their take on this is and to get some more answers on how an inmate in a facility like this that's built to treat uh, inmates that need long term medical care can be in that position where they would be in the ability to be attacked by that inmate. 